started on BC Ridge guitars. For me, after I got my first BC Ridge, it was a mod, it's like a 77 Mockingbird, pretty cool. Um, no, what I was into was the Warlock because it was a completely different design. And you know, if you saw that shape, you're like, hey, that's BC Ridge. Look at this one. This is what I call first generation graphics. That was the first BC that I had with tribal um, artwork on it. And from that, as far as V's go, we went to this. Not necessarily the flame, but the, the big 2Ks. Like on this one, a lot of people don't know, but my tattoo guy made 2Ks here for Kerry King, and then he made the 2Ks bigger for the secondary one. I call this second generation. And then, you know, they got different backgrounds, different K colors, but, you know, same idea. cool designs. I got one of the sickest painters on the planet and I'm really proud of it. All my guitars have that now. Yeah, you know, we just throw ideas around and, you know, the the flame, if you get a painter that can actually pull it off and then to have the, the cool tribal design over it, it makes it more than one dimensional. It makes it very three dimensional and, you know, just like if, if somebody never knew who Kerry King was, saw this guitar, I think they'd want it because it looks cool. You know, regardless of what you think of me, this guitar looks awesome. You got the bitch, you got the warlock, now you got the beast and the virgin and the one, what's that one? The Draco? You know, just all these crazy designs and, and BC Rich is a kind of company when you see the guitar, you know, they're not, they're not basing their whole line on Strat ripoffs and Les Paul ripoffs. They're basing it on their own styles, very pointy, very edgy. I've always been a V guy. So I want, I want a 24 fret V with a Kaler on it. And you know, look what we got now, Jesus. I think my guitars are good for anybody. I mean, um, the funny thing is when I do guitar abuse, which is my in-store things I do when I play, and I bring, like, I'll bring a guitar like this, I'll bring my actual guitar and let kids play it. Um, you know, people always say, if they're sitting down, they're like, oh man, how do I play this thing? I'm like, dude, just put it on your leg, it ain't going nowhere. Yeah. 